useful uh, explaining with this uh, with this Lawton circuit um, hooked into my Maya type cell. Um, yeah, the Lawton circuit as described by Patrick Kelly. Um, Patrick Kelly sent me through some um, updated circuit diagrams here where the frequency and duty cycle adjustment pots are um, in a different arrangement there between pin 3 and pin 7 for frequency and pin 7 and 6 for uh, duty cycle. Um, also the circuit um, now has two um, inductors in there. Um, the coils are wound out of um, 0.63 millimeter. Um, they specify here 22 SWG, which I think is 0.7 of a millimeter. Um, I couldn't find any of that, so um, don't know how much difference that will make. But that's the only variation there in this circuit. Otherwise, than that, uh, 100 turns down the ferrite rod. Um, yeah, and this circuit seems to work. Um, yeah, a bit better than the other ones, but still you'll see when I um, adjust the frequency, which I'll do now, after I'll just adjust the duty cycle there, so it's about 50%, you can see there on the oscilloscope. Um, as I adjust the frequency now though, you'll notice that the duty cycle needs to be readjusted if I want to try and keep that 50% duty cycle like I had it before. Um, as I adjust the 50% duty cycle, then you can also see that the frequency there changes. So it's a little bit uh, better, but not quite um, independent like the uh, document claims. But um, yeah, it's sort of that the only gripe I really have about that is that the um, adjustments are difficult to make. Um, but kind of workable I guess if you just want to poke around and I think that's what this was designed for just to visually try and find a more a higher um, gas production rate there in the cell um, but I've noticed that the, the same as in my first video um, the highest amount of gas production is when I either hook um, straight DC across the cell um, or uh, which is pretty much the same thing if I adjust the duty cycle so that it's high full on there as you can see um, that would be as low that would be low duty cycle so lots of space and this would be lots of mark. So having lots of mark, like up there, or high duty cycle, then um, I get my most frequent gas production there. So I get a good shot. Um, but yeah, as you can see, um, now that this is distilled water, it's nothing like what I had with my tap water originally in the other cell. Um, and yeah, it's about one and a half amps, just over one and a half amps that I get um, through this cell either with straight DC or with a high duty cycle. Um, yeah, so nothing overly impressive out of this. Um, the other thing I tried was some bifilar wound um, coils instead of just the normal wound coils. Um, so yeah, uh, those ones, that, that coil here, the one I've got hooked in, is like what Patrick describes, just 100 turns over the ferrite rod, just in a line, where um, the other style was to use, um, yeah, bifilar, which is, um, I wrap two wires around, and then once I get to the end, take one of the connections on the end and bring it back to the start. Um, yeah, so um, that's it 
For now, um, this is the bubbles, bubble count there, um, about one bubble a second. You can see high duty cycle, but yeah, if I bring that back down to about 50% mark space and um, look around with frequencies, uh, you'll notice that the cell clears up quite a bit and um, gas production rate goes down. So no matter, so no matter where in the frequency range I go, um, yeah, it doesn't seem to be anything over impressive. The only thing I notice is sometimes I hear it um, more. I don't know if that's to do with resonance or just my ears. Um, yeah, um, 13.8 volts out of the power supply there. Um, into the circuit, it's all hanging out the back there, but yeah, two triple fives went up the oscilloscope just at the um, gate of the uh, buzz um, MOSFET there. And um, yeah, uh, next week I'll show you, or when, as soon as I get it put back together again, this series cell that's lying there on the ground, I'll, I'll show you in like one litre a minute that I get through that and measure it there. but. No point hooking the bottles up to this because, as you can see, um, barely even 